In downtown Flint, the buzz of late has been all about the new renovation and construction. And as people look to the northern border of downtown, many have asked, so what exactly is going on with the old Durant Hotel? Well, ABC 12's Kathy Schaffron was asking that same question. And from the looks of things, Kathy, it appears someone might have come up with the answers. Yeah, I actually, as you can see, the Durant on my hard hat, a true song that I made my way inside the building today. And what I thought I would do is bring folks up to speed, so to speak, on the changes that I've been seeing over the past nine months or so, ever since developers moved in there and started to turn this 1920s era hotel into brand new state-of-the-art loft apartments. The remnants of what once was a grand lobby could be seen earlier this year looking like this. This is the main entry, the grand lobby right here. Today, it looks more like this. Can we take a look at the, um, the uh, dining room? Dining room, sure. The grand dining hall that stood in its splendor last year, today looks like this. You can see the, the monumental windows still remain. But within seven months, the developers say, after concrete and masonry restoration, the main floor will return to its historic nature. You see a, uh, a 1920s era grandiose hotel lobby. From the second to the eighth floor, though, Carp says residents will move into the modern world with 93 upscale apartments. Granite countertops in every unit, stainless steel appliances, open floor plan and 10 megabit uh, internet service. Above the penthouse suites will be a sun deck for residents with a barbecue and lounge chairs. With our green roof around it. Green meaning? It will be a live, growing roof with uh, sedum as the plant that we'll be using. Behind the main desk in the front lobby, there will be a large window and a walkway to a 250-space parking deck. CARP says that will be available for both residents and the public, and both will be able to use the new retail space at the street level as well. It's slated for retail. Uh, we actually have interest from a number of, of individuals who would like to do a bar or restaurant there. So that's the vision that CARP has. He says that vision will be coming to reality in this building by the end of this year. He says details of all the details on it will be on the website in a couple of months, thedurant.com. Reporting live in downtown Flint, Kathy Schaffron, ABC 12 News. And by the way, Kathy, that's a lovely hard hat you're done.